Hi, Larry Gaines, PowerCycleTrading.com. In this video, I want to walk you through how to use a protective collar. So it's a hedging strategy that you can use for specific stocks, or you can even use it for an equity stock portfolio. So let's take a look at this example here. So this is Microsoft, and I'll walk you through the kind of the, the process here. So Microsoft went long on the 25th of August, 100 shares at $215 per share. And then when it pushed up on the 28th, made an adjustment to protect and hedge the trade. So we, uh, on the 28th then bought a long put the 215 right here to protect the downside and then shorted a 240 call to the upside so basically you're buying the long put and financing it with the short strike uh, call up here out of the market and currently you can see where it's trading at 228.91 so here's what it looks like uh, on the analytics so first off let's go through the math so here's the cost to implement the collar on the 28th so 100 shares of Microsoft at 215 per share and then bought the 215 put the 18 September monthly expiration the, and paid $3.15 per contract for that put and then sold the 240 call the 18 September and received 440 or 440 uh, on that. So net net, you look at that, you've got a collar that you put, set up for a credit of $1.25. Now our break even then is 215 the cost of the shares of stock less that credit because we brought that in as profit, potentially credit. And so the break even now is 213.75. Max profit at 240, you take that 240 short call here, 440. Uh, and then plus the dollar twenty five credit minus your share cost. And so in this example, if it was to close at uh, two forty, um, on expiration uh, next week uh, or above, you'd make $2,625 or 12.21% return on your 100 shares. But the, here's the big part. Your break even is capped at 215. So you can see even if it goes at 215 or lower, based on this, you've got the 215 minus, that's your put minus the 215 share price plus the credit. So you'd e e end up even making a dollar or $125 per 100 uh, shares so, or 1%. So that's the beauty of that downside risk protection. So capping it. So that's why we call it the cost. Now let's take a look at where it is currently. So here are the analytics you can see on the 28th. At that point in time on the 28th, this trade was up $1,370. So you got a big pop here where my pointer is 215. Your, your share price went up to 228 and then you're short the 240 uh, call. A little bit of profit in there and then long the 315 put. But here's the big thing now. So let's take a look here uh, on Tuesday this week and then I'll show you where it is currently today. So on Tuesday the 8th, it was went out trading at 202.76. So you can see where it was trading right down here here 202 right in this level so you can see that the stock price had broken below that 215 but let's take a look and see what this cap uh, collar did for your trade so it's trading there on Tuesday the 8th at 202.76 so that the total trade uh, revenue was up $291 even though the market had dropped down at 202.76 below your cost of your uh, long shares so if you go through the math you can see your shares at 215 uh, went down to a value of 202.77 so your stock had lost a thousand two hundred twenty three dollars approximately and then the 240 call here's where you start making the money back you shorted at 440 on uh, the 8th that was trading at 41 cents so you're making it back on your hedge okay so you're you can see you had a loss on the stock and then you buy you could you know the the value of that 440 short uh, 240 call was at 41 cents so that was a, a revenue or profit there um, of 399 dollars and then the puts the 215 puts that were bought for 315 dollars per option were now valued at 1,004 30 so up a uh, thousand one one five so net net you know you're still up 291 on that trade now here's where Microsoft is trading today this is the 10th and it's trading right now while I'm doing this video about 20657 right here you can see so let's take a look at the risk profile of the option analytics to see what that collar is looking like currently so here's the beauty of the collar so if you just own the stock right here 100 shares at 215 and you hadn't done nothing no hedging at all currently today you'd be down about 840 dollars uh, on those hundred shares but but by hedging, here's what it looks like. With the collar hedge, you're actually up about $300. So huge difference. So if you're trading stocks or an equity portfolio, this is one great strategy to do. So you can see that the 240 short call at 440 that you originally set up now has dropped down to about 17 bucks. So good profit there. 215 puts that you bought at 315 uh, are up over 1060, 1070. So you're making the profit back on your hedge. So I hope this helps. Uh, and if you'd like to learn more about uh, option strategies, make sure to use the link on this um, newsletter and join us at PowerCycleTrading.com for free webinars. Good luck trading.